Here's a quick tutorial about sweeping a shape along a path. So we're going to start with our uh, initial uh, layout of our, our area that we're using. Um, and uh, what we're going to do is we're going to sketch um, the, uh, the shape of a cap, a stone cap that's going to go on this wall. Um, and uh, we're going to use the sketch command and do it on this front face here. And uh, it's just a really simple cap. Um, it's, uh, it's about two inches tall. Um, it overhangs maybe about an inch on either side and it comes up to a, a little bit of a, uh, a pyramid or kind of like a peak shaped. So I'm putting in two inches. I'm going to bring it up to the top here and, uh, and then make the piece that comes across the top like that. Okay, and uh, I am going to just complete this face right here. And uh, okay, you'll see it turns orange to indicate that it's a closed face, so we're all good. Zoom in a little bit. Um, and now I just want to constrain it to make sure that it looks proper, so I'm going to make a couple things uh, vertical, um, and uh, I want to make some things equal um, just to make sure it's symmetrical across. Okay, now I have my face set up, so I'm going to exit out of my sketch, um, and, uh, and then I'm just going to pivot around so I can see the top um, of the surface because I need to create the path that I'm going to um, drag this through or sweep it through. Um, so once I get this into view here, um, I am going to uh, create another sketch, but this time this sketch will be on the top surface of the wall. Um, and I'm going to create a line that goes um, the midpoint on the wall, the top surface of the wall that goes all the way around. So I'm going to enter into the sketch function, zoom out so I can see the entire thing, um, and then just create a line that runs uh, the, uh, the entire way around um, where I want this cap to sweep through and uh, try to get this as close to the center as possible. We can adjust it if it's not perfect after. And then bring it back to the end here. And uh, once I finish that, I'll use some constraints just to make sure that it's exactly where I want it. Uh, the bottom one is not parallel, so I got to fix that first. Um, and then the one to the left, I just want to drag a little bit to, uh, to make sure that um, it's in the center of that wall. Let me fix that. OK, so that's over constrained. I'm going to drag it to the center of that wall. Good, and I'm just about set with my path. So I'm going to stop the sketch, and now I have my face that I want to sweep through the path and the actual path that I want it to take. So let's zoom in so I can see this happen here. And then I'm going to go to Create and Sweep. Uh, the first thing is I'm going to select the profile, and then the next thing is I'm going to select the path. And it puts the cap all the way around. I want to make sure that I'm creating a new body because I want to keep this separate. And uh, just hit OK to finish it off. And what we have is a nice cap on top of the wall, um, getting closer to a more realis realistic model of, uh, of what we're looking at.